I was in the United States Navy. I was a hull technician, HT2, uh, when I served on the USS Davis, a destroyer out of Charleston, South Carolina. I was in the United States Marine Corps. I was a Lance Corporal. I worked for HMH 461. I worked on military helicopters. I was an aviation electrician. I was in the Navy. I was with Sink Westland, Commander-in-Chief Western Atlantic, which is a NATO. And what we did was we sent out all the different NATO publications to the different NATO nations. I enlisted in the Air Force in 1971. Uh, a little story behind that was I was attending the University of Minnesota. I was part of the first um, lottery draft. My number was two. Didn't want to go in the Army, so I went down and enlisted in the Air Force. U.S. Navy Master at Arms Seaman Apprentice. I was in the Air Force and I was an airman first class. I was in the Air Force in the late 80s, early 90s, and um, I was just an enlisted. I, was, I came out as a, like an airman first class. It was an opportunity to learn discipline and camaraderie with other service members. The education that I got and the respect for others and respect for authority and just something inside changes. When I got out, I realized with the training I had received how uh, welcomed that training was to employers and uh, it really helped me to establish myself in my professional career. To me, it's honor um, and the commitment that I was able to actually go through and be able to serve my country and be available to help in need for our country and to defend America. It gave me a sense of responsibility. Everything I do has, has a consequence that I am responsible for because it was a decision I made. I joined the Navy in hopes of being a part of something bigger than myself and to honor my family. I come from a military family. Both my grandfathers, uncles, cousins, father, and little brother are currently serving or have served. It meant to me that I was helping to protect the freedoms and the liberties that my family and my friends and the rest of the people in the country enjoy. It's something I'm proud of. I'm something I'm glad that I did. I think it, it does change people a little bit. It means a lot to me, and it means a lot to me because I served, but also as an American. I think it's important that uh, we support our military, and uh, whatever your politics are aside, uh, certainly it's important for us to support our military members. The, the satisfaction of doing that job and the appreciation of, of people that you run into in all parts of the world for what you're doing is, is something that Unless you do it, you don't have any idea what, what that means.